everybody. I saw in your comments, you all like Sun Jack scallops. So I'm going to do another recipe for you with scallops. Here they are, the scallops. Yummy, yummy scallops. And we've got some grated cheese, maybe one big cup of grated cheese, because we've only got a few scallops, okay? Some pepper, just normal grounded pepper, garlic, some butter. You need only maybe half of that, okay? Maybe half. So that's about a quarter of a box. And breadcrumbs, okay? So, first, what we're going to do is open up the cocky sand jack. We're going to open up the scallops. Very, very simple, okay? Just be careful at the edges because sometimes they break easily. Okay? I'll just get the knife and I'll show you how to do it. Okay, so this is how you do one of these scallops. See, they're already a little bit open because this is the fish. So all you do, you see, it's joined inside. I don't know if you can see that. So that's where it's attached. So we're going to unattach it. And then it will just open by itself, you see? Very simple. And then we remove this part because we won't be using this. And what you do, give it a good rinse under the water, okay? So it's clean, get all your sand or whatever out. And then we prepare the rest, okay? I'll, I'll continue doing that. I'll be back. Okay, do you remember the two pieces of garlic? Uh, that's what they look like now and there's your butter you see you don't really need too much eh? okay so what we're going to do is we're going to heat up the butter and at the same time when it's heating up we're going to stir this garlic into it and then while it's cooking we're going to add the grated cheese to make a smooth sauce then I'll show you what we do after that okay okay that's it Remember, that's your garlic, butter, and the cheese, grated cheese, all melted together. It's gone to like a little sauce, you see? Don't worry if it's not completely mixed in. There's usually some little bits like that. So, what you're going to do with this, you're watching, get one of your scallops, maybe one or two spoons, cover it over, and there you go. That should do for that one. So, once it's like that, you can add, it doesn't have to be pepper, right? You can add whatever you want. Lemon juice, lemon juice, curry powder, whatever you, whatever ingredients you want, okay? It's up to you, the choice. And just to make it a little more interesting, we've got some breadcrumbs. Cover that. Few breadcrumbs on the top, and that's how we do it. I'll continue like that, and I'll show you how it looks ready for eating. And there it is, fresh out of the oven, still very, very hot. So don't eat them straight away, okay? Just wait maybe two or three minutes to let them cool down a bit, and then get your teeth into them. See you in my next recipe. Bye bye.